20 points. International friendly De Gea doing little to dispel rumours. Social media sites were said to be buzzing this morning with news that De Gea could be on his way out of Manchester United after a bust up with an unidentified teammate. According to Peyton, the fracas was merely a case of handbags, He did, but did result in De Gea speeding away from the ground, scattering photographers and autograph hunters lingering at the training ground gates. De Gea had report, has reportedly found life difficult away from more familiar surroundings and has left it, let his agent know that he would consider a move. Wow! Speeding away from the training ground. Scattering photographers and autograph hunters. Wow! Wow, wow, wow. Can we find this guy? What a dick! I'm thinking, because they're international friendlies, that we will just sim these matches. I'm going to sim this match. Belgium versus Spain. Starting with Casius, Ramos, PK, Alba, Iniesta, Fabregas. Alright, so uh, we've kicked off. It's 1-0 to Belgium. Hazard with the goal. It's not looking good at the moment. PK with the yellow card. We're 1-0 down. Alright, second half and it's still 1-0 to Belgium. There he goes. Santi Cazorla. The goal is 1-0. Uh, full time. Belgium 1. Spain 1. Right, another international friendly. It's Spain versus Northern Ireland. We're going to sim this one again. So there's not much behind it. Going to be starting with the same side that drew 1-0 with Belgium. Here we go. Fabregas with the yellow card already. Two minutes in. Dear, oh dear. It's 1-0 to Spain. Soldado with the goal. Yellow card for Soldado, the goal scorer. Half time. It's 1-0. Second half. Pedro comes on. Or Busquets, I should say. Because all is on. Still 1-0. 2-0 now. Soldado with the goal again. Can he get a hat-trick before the end of the game? No. 2-0. Full time. Good victory. Alright, back to Manchester United now. Phil Jones. Phil Jones will be out for seven days with a pulled hamstring. Alrighty guys, we're moving on to our next fixture in the Barclays Premier League. It's Sunderland versus Manchester United. We're playing away. Here is the league table. We had such a horrible defeat against Aston Villa. Which means City are just two points behind us now. So we need to win this game. Miss Sunderland start 11. I thought, no, that's right. A do is on Southampton's team. I'm getting Sunderland and Southampton mixed up. What a douche. Phil Bardsley, ex Man United player, he starts. Johnson G. It's an alright team for uh, Sunderland. Here's United's side Lindgarni goal, Larm, Hummels, Riddich, Butner, Fletcher, Eriksen, Valencia, Bale, Ronaldo, and Neymar. Rooney on the bench hasn't been uh, on top form at the moment. Nor is Van Persie, and Lindengard is in goal because of De Gea. He's not doing the best because he wants to leave England altogether. Oh, that's going to be a free kick. That's a free kick to Sunderland. I need to be careful with this. Because they could quite easily pick up a goal here. Lindengard with the save. Full stretch. Still nil nil. They got a corner though. Swing it in. Oh, Sunderland have opened up the scoring. Otamendi, the 11th minute, a beautiful set piece from Sunderland, finding his head, Lindegar beaten, 1-0, Fletcher down to Valencia, Valencia with the shot, goalkeeper with the save again, it's another corner for Manchester United, Valencia swinging it in, Fidic, Hummels with the header, too easy, wasn't enough power behind that head, Bringing on some fresh legs, taking off Valencia and Neymar for Rooney and Manny. Oh, look at this. Oh, it's a penalty. Of course it's a penalty. Come on. They are just out for us, aren't they, these referees? Lindegaard, come on, son. Oh, it's 2-0 to Sunderland. 73rd minute. Oh. It wasn't a penalty. These last two fixtures I feel really hard done by. 
We've been performing. We just haven't been able to score. Lindegaard unable to save that penalty. Oh dear. There's no excuse. We shouldn't be losing 2-0 to Sunderland. And that's the end of the game. I feel so frustrated at the moment. 2-0 to Sunderland. A world-class team we have with Ronaldo, Rooney, Neymar. So many other players that there's no excuse we shouldn't be losing to Sunderland. What am I playing at? Alright guys, after those last two horrible fixtures in the Premier League, we are now playing in the Champions League against Benfica. It's going to be a top match this. Last time we faced them at Old Trafford, we lost 2-0. We need to book up our ideas. We really do. Here is the, the group stage. We are level on points with Benfica. They are top by goal difference. Here's Benfica's side. They got Witzel they're starting him out again. We need to watch him. He is one of their top guys. He's the guy that won that penalty and scored it as well in the last fixture against them. Here's our starting 11. I'm starting to hear again. Lam, Hummels, Vidic, Butner, Kagawa, Cleverly, Valencia, Nani, Welbeck and Neymar. Ronaldo, Rooney, Van Persie, Raphael and Bale all on the bench as we are resting them. Need to book up our ideas. Oh that's a wonderful pass there from Tom Cleverly. Butner back to Cleverly. Kagawa. Makes good use of the ball, doesn't he? Beautiful movement from Manchester United. What a shot from Neymar. Now, what can they produce from the corner? Valencia with the corner. Curling it in. Tom Cleverley with the shot off the crossbar. Rockets against the crossbar. Oh, that is an amazing pass to Larm. What is Larm doing all the way up here? I do not know. But Larm goes in. Oh, what the crossbar! How was that not a goal? Oh, is that a penalty? It's offside. Oh, Lam with the shot, hits the crossbar, comes back out. Lam getting himself all in that attacking position. How is it not 1-0? We've hit the crossbar twice now. Same position. Benfica are through, they've got to make it one. De Gea comes out with a beautiful save from Manchester United. Off goes Welbeck and Nani for Ronaldo and Van Persie. Bring on some fresh legs. Neymar now. Oh, wonderful pass to Van Persie for Man United. And it goes over. My word, this goalkeeper is on fire today. Corner. Valencia swinging it in. Oh, saved again. No. Off the line. How is it not 1-0 yet? What is going on? What a game. What a game full of chances. And I feel as though we should have walked away with the win there. I feel cheated out of a win. Very tough game. Benfica, they just sat back and defended. But I suppose we'll move on from this fixture into our next fixture in the Champions League against Club Bruges. Alrighty, guys. Next fixture in the Barclays Premier League. We're back at Old Trafford. It's Manchester United versus West Bromwich Albion again. <laughs> Here's the league table. As we've seen before, we are just one point top above City on 32 points. We need to book up our ideas. We haven't been in the best of form recently. The past couple of fixtures in the Premier League, we've lost both games. Our last two games, I should say. Starting 11 to here, Larm, Hummels, Vidic, Butner, Fletcher, Kagawa, Cleverly. No, not Cleverly, Nani, Bale, Welbeck, and Rooney are messing up my, uh, my team. <laughs> Corner, early on in the game, Nani to take. Swinging it in, and it's 1-0 to Manchester United, thanks to Hummels. Mats Hummels, fourth minute. 1-0. Nani took the corner. Swings it in. Finds Hummels' his head. Beautiful. On to Butner. Look at the space Butner has been given here. And look at the pace on this lad. Finds it well back. Ben Foster. <laughs> He's gone in. Gareth Bale with the goal. 2-0 to United. 32nd minute. Absolute madness. I so didn't mean to do that. Welbeck and Foster both tripping over each other. There goes Welbeck. There goes Foster. And Bale makes it 2-0 to Manchester United. Wicked. Brunt with the cross in. And United have it back. On the break now. Danny Welbeck. Looking for Gareth Bale. 
and with Gareth Bale's pace he can take the ball into the box find it Wayne Rooney Wayne Rooney he hasn't scored for a while but he has now he makes it 3-0 to Manchester United 74th minute Gareth Bale's pace brings it in finds Rooney's head with a nice cross time to bring on some fresh legs now taking off Kagawa and well back for Van Persie in Valencia it's full time here at Old Trafford West Brom will be happy this game is over Yet we walk away with the win 3-0 thanks to Wayne Rooney Bale and Hummels getting on the score sheet Rooney's back goal scoring once again guys thanks for taking the time to watch this video be sure to leave a comment rate the video and if you haven't done already please subscribe peace out Viva la